Well, the Republican proposal to continue Medicaid expansion in Montana is nearly ready for introduction. And MTN News has acquired a copy of the almost final draft of the bill. MTN Chief Political Reporter Mike Dennison has the details. Medicaid expansion, which provides government-funded health coverage to 95,000 low-income adults in Montana, is set to expire in June. Governor Steve Bullock and fellow Democrats say it should be extended in its current form. But Republicans at the legislature want to make some changes, and now we have the blueprint for what those changes entail. State Representative Ed Buttry of Great Falls will carry the GOP bill. He told MTN News Saturday he may make an additional change before introducing it, but that the current draft is pretty much done. As expected, it will require most recipients to have 80 hours a month of community engagement, which could be a job, workforce training, community service, or other activities. Participants would self-report these hours and the state would audit those reports. Governor Bullock has been critical of such requirements. I would say not only does it cost more to administer than provide the benefits, uh, but also significant gains or reductions of access to health care. We're certainly going to have to come together and find a solution that's uh, best for the state and for all Montanans. The Buttry Bill draft has some new fees as well to help pay the state's share of the $700 million a year program, a 0.825% fee on hospital outpatient revenue, a new 1% premium tax on nonprofit health insurers like the Montana Health Co-op, and imposing the 2.75% state premium tax on the state work comp fund. Expanded Medicaid covers adults earning up to 138% of the federal poverty level, about $17,200 a year for a single person. Buttry's bill requires participants to pay premiums equal to 2% of their annual income and has a revised asset test that could charge higher fees to anyone who owns considerable assets such as real estate. And another thing, the bill would place limits on medical malpractice liability for physicians and others. Suffice it to say, the debate over Medicaid expansion will be one of the biggest political battles of the session. Reporting from Helena, Mike Dennison, MTN News. Mike says both proposals sponsored by Representative Mary Caffaro of Helena will be heard before the House Human Services Committee on March 16th.